Welcome to Key Tech. Please describe this channel if you are interesting in today's video. ASML of the Netherlands, the world's top lithography machine company, is a dominant player in the high-end field, especially 5 nanometers high-precision EUV lithography machines. ASML is the only company in the world that can produce it. However, due to the interference of the United States, ASML has never been able to export to other countries since it manufactured an extreme ultraviolet lithography equipment in Europe. ASML does not have the ability to completely independent intellectual property rights on EUV lithography machines. According to published data, its core light source technology, objective lenses, and dual desktop systems are all imported from the United States and Germany. ASML technology only accounts for about 10%, and the actual role of ASML is assembly. This is also the reason why the Chinese R&D team went to ASML in the Netherlands to learn experience. As a result, they were ridiculed by ASML, even if you give China a blueprint, you can't make it. Obviously, for foreign companies, China does not have complete supply channels and related patents, and it is simply a wishful thinking to manufacture EUV lithography machines. There is even a domestic expert who holds the same view. He said at this year's 5th International Digital Technology Conference, extreme ultraviolet lithography is the wisdom of people all over the world, and its main supply sources are more than 30 countries and more than 50 countries. With more than a thousand manufacturers, it is difficult for China alone to completely solve it, and the EUV process is not a dead end. It is better to focus on the 28 nanometers process. China should pay more attention to the 28 nanometers process superior. In the eyes of many netizens, the spirit of awe conveyed by these scholars' speeches is that although 70% of the current mainstream market is still manufactured by mature chip processes, iterating on higher level processes is of this trend. If the tone is not set in advance, the situation of keeping pace with each other will definitely reappear. It can be said that EUV lithography is a very difficult thing, but the US government is taking it step by step. They have no choice but to solve domestic problems. In addition, as Wang Chuanfu, chairman of BYD, said, no matter how cutting-edge technological equipment is, it is man-made and not created by God. What foreign countries can do, China can also do, and even do better than foreign countries. What's more, Although the development of EUV is difficult, is there still an aircraft carrier difficulty? Domestic research units represented by the Chinese Academy of Sciences have successively conquered multiple EUV lithography machines, including light sources, objective lenses, etc. Later, ASML suddenly changed its mind and claimed that China can also be applied to physics, and anything can be done. Later, it even warned the United States, never sell photolithography machines to China. China will buy all this technology in at most three to five years, and ASML is likely to go bankrupt by then. Obviously, the rapid development of domestic lithography technology has touched ASML's sensitive nerves. 
The reason is simple. Once the extreme ultraviolet lithography machine is produced domestically, if ASML cannot produce it in mass production, it means that they will miss more market opportunities. More importantly, compared to the low prices of Made in China, ASML has no confidence in winning in the world's photolithography field, and its industrial position will inevitably be weakened. Because of this, ASML has repeatedly conducted price dumping on Chinese lithography equipment in the past few years, and invested more than 3,000 patents in Chinese tablet computers. Its intention is very obvious. First, it is to introduce domestic lithography technology into the home furnishing field. Second, from the perspective of patent rights, China cannot break away from this obsession. However, what ASML did not expect was that despite exhausting all means to block, it still could not stop the pace of the ice age of domestic photolithography technology. On August 15, according to an application for Exposure Imaging Structure, Reflective Photo Mask and Projection Lithography, released by Shanghai Chuangsen Company, a brand new application was granted. It is understood that this method can significantly improve the resolution and contrast of lithographic printing equipment and can simplify the conventional lithographic printing process. If breakthroughs in basic EUV processes, such as light sources, have made domestic lithography machines a big step forward in the work of two legs, these core technologies gathered by Shanghai Core Printing will surely the future of domestic lithography machines will take off with wings. It's clear that ASML is concerned about what's going on. Chinese companies have mastered their own core technology. Photolithography is no longer the weakness of domestic chips, and ASML's patent barrel will become worthless. It should be noted that the United States and the Netherlands are negotiating on DUV restrictions in China, which will undoubtedly add fuel to the current situation of ASML. Therefore, when the United States asks ASML to restrict the import of photolithography machines to China, it is likely to disrupt the supply chain of the entire semiconductor industry and plunge the entire semiconductor industry into chaos. This also means that ASML is also worried about its future. They want further cooperation with China because China is their largest market, especially when the semiconductor market is declining. Doing business is all about profit. This opportunity in mainland China may be the last straw on ASML's shoulder, which is why ASML dares to do this. Now that it has reached this point, ASML will still use more light as he wishes. Are engraving machines exported to China? China will wait and see.